Did you spot this dancing on ice gaff? Dancing on Ice launched tonight on ITV after a four-year break off our screens. And it was clear that ITV show bosses had thrown everything at tonight's show, offering a two-hour spectacular which featured a Technicolor group performance, high-energy routines and a new-look studio. But even with all these shiny new additions to the show, it didn't stop the Dancing on Ice presenter Holly Willoughby falling prey to a blunder live on air. After dropping a filthy innuendo live on air about her buns with Jordan Banjo, the blonde bombshell, alongside Tully husband Philip Schofield, introduced the second dancer on air, Great British Bake Off winner Candace Brown. Will the Bake Off star rise to the occasion, or will she end up with a soggy bottom? It's Candace Brown and her partner Matt Evers. Holly Willoughby the 36-year-old announced, will the Bake Off star rise to the occasion, or will she end up with a soggy bottom? It's Candace Brown and her partner Matt Evers. However, halfway through her announcement, her microphone cut off leaving fans straining to hear exactly what she said. This was not the only gaffe that happened on Dancing on Ice tonight, with commentator Matt Chapman accidentally announcing the wrong judge when giving out Love Island's Kim Settine scores. Meaning to call for acid-tongued judge Jason to give his score, Matt accidentally called for Jane Torville, leading to an awkward pause. But in spite of the blips, fans were loving the return of the Deep Freeze dance show, taking to Twitter to praise the return of the program. So happy dancing on eyes is back. I've missed it being on my tally for the last four years. Said one keen viewer. Another gleefully tweeted, happy to see Dancing on Ice back on our TV screens. It's been a great start to the series. A third added, never been so happy that Dancing on Ice is back. The launch show saw six couples take to the ring, with the following six to continue next Sunday and the first elimination next week. But who will be the first to go? Dancing on Eyes continues next Sunday at 6pm on ITV.